Good morning, everyone. Clearly, lots of you are concerned about the future of cash, given the rise of contactless payments. Some shops, as I say, have refused banknotes and coins during the pandemic. And last year, we withdrew a lot less cash, £81 billion. That's still a huge amount of money, but that's actually down nearly 40% on the amount we took out the year before. Now, despite that, the average UK consumer still took out £1,500 last year. So cash is not dead. And for vulnerable people or those in rural communities, it's more important than ever. The problem is the number of ATMs fell by 10% last year. And the post office has plans to cut a third of its cash machines over the next year or so. Now, Ruth runs a post office in a village in County Durham. The nearby bank is closing and her post office ATM was threatened too, but she wasn't having any of it and took action. Not everybody just wants to use the card to pay for things. They like cash in the hands if the, you know, if the on a budget, more so if the on a budget, it's vital for the community. It's vital to keep it so that there's a lot of vulnerable people uh, elderly people who are uh, living within a budget need access to free cash. And obviously it is a free cash machine. You're not charged to use it. Um, so it was vital for the community. And it was also vital for my viability uh, to keep the business going.